Inside, Vance Jackson to the basket, and with English, he makes that one in. Diagonal pass, Goldman with a jab from Derrickson. For UConn, Adams, beautiful handle, nice look, Enoch with the flush. And a steal. As Facey just plucks it out, Purvis to and jam. Here comes Adams. Diagonal pass wide open, Purvis. Adams has been brilliant. The lob, baseline, Bryant! Woo! I got you off your chair. Woo! You lost your chair. Not That's what I thought. <laughs> Peek again down the lane. Hell bent, picked it up. Govan for three. Jesse Govan. The big man stepping out. Rodney Pryor still trying to find his rhythm offensively. Purvis to Adams. Again, Jalen Adams is on fire. Baseline, Govan. He's been hot. And he remains hot. And Grima has fouled out. Here's LJP using that body. LJP. A series that goes all the way back to 1958. So the Huskies will inbound it on the baseline. And they'll find him. They'll have to go for three. Adams pulls up for the tie. Short. Peak with the rebound. They play keep away. And George Donald get out of there. Thanks so much, Coach. You know, when we spoke yesterday, you told me one of the keys to this game was going to be rebounds. I saw you have to wipe some of the sweat off of your forehead when they were playing volley under here. What did you think about the fight you saw? I was I was sweating <laughs> sweating my forehead the whole the whole game. Um, but I thought our guys fought. You know, I thought our guys fought, and we competed. I don't know what the rebound numbers are. I haven't seen it. Uh, you know, there was a couple down there. We I wish we'd come up with, but. You know, I think the guy who you're going to talk to next made big plays as he always has. He just, when, when we need things done, LJ Peak makes things happen. That's right. You know, when you look at the losses that you guys start in conference play, how do you think you guys grew from that? Uh, well, I mean, those losses are rough, but we can't dwell on that. You know, I told the guys we got a lot of season ahead of us, and let's just keep getting better. And we come up with two pretty good wins right here, and we want to just keep it going. And I think the guys called your bluff today because you told me that they go into a lull in the second half. What was different tonight? I thought we did go into a lull. I mean, we come out the second half, they scored like the first six or eight points in a row, didn't they? That's, that's a lull for us. 22 four runs, pretty good. Thanks so much, Coach. Thank you. Thanks so much. Down here with LJ Peak. Oh, what a game for you guys. The fight that we saw out of you in the second half. How much fun is it when you come out of the locker room and go on a 22 four run? Oh, we came out slow and Coach told us to pick it up, so we had to come out with it. How do you stay locked in during a time like that when, when you might be able to take your foot off the gas a little bit? Well, Coach keeps us grounded, so he just tells us keep pushing, keep pushing, so we never give up. What was your biggest motivation? You guys start the conference play with three losses. What kept you guys motivated and pushing forward? We never gave up, so we're just going to keep playing regardless. What did you think about that block by Agao to end the game? I love it. We won the game. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you.